Well, smash and grabs continue to happen throughout Detroit. The latest happening overnight in Gross Point Park. Police were originally seeking five men, but now there could be even more involved. 7 Action News reporter Ali Hoxie is live outside Howlers and Growlers in Gross Point Park right now with more information on this investigation. Ali. Well, police say it was 2 a.m. when a van backed up into howlers and growlers, breaking through and stealing an ATM with $900 inside. Gross Point Park police say that they are working with others and an investigation is underway to a string of smash and grabs. Yeah. Moses Movesian lives it's next kind of door to howlers and growlers. He heard a loud crash this morning. I was sitting on my back deck and I ran out to the front thinking my car got hit. And I looked and there was a red van. He chalked it up to people working next door. But Gross Point Park police say it was a smash and grab captured on surveillance video. They are not yet releasing to the public. They reviewed the videotape and it looks like a full size uh, work van with no uh, no, no windows. Gross Point Park police say the van was stolen out of Detroit yesterday. This afternoon, they recovered the van along with the ATM stolen from howlers and growlers. The ATM pried open. A few weeks ago, Detroit police asked the community to be on the lookout for five men wanted in a string of smash and grabs. Right now, four of those five men are in custody. Police are still looking for one more, Ivan Austin. Detroit police are still investigating if this latest smash and grab at Howlers and Growlers is related to Austin and the other four men now in custody. For now, people remain on high alert. Pretty scary. Um, just got to really look out for the neighborhood, look out for the people that live around you. The Gross Point Park Police Department is working with the Detroit Police Department to help and continue in this investigation. Reporting live in Gross Point Park, Allie Hoxie, 7 Action News. Allie, thanks.